We'd like now to take just a few moments with someone who is going to be our guest speaker next Sunday while Pastor Ben is away helping out with some uh, family business. Um, but we wanted to take just a couple of minutes here this Sunday to give you a chance to hear what's coming up next for Eric and uh, why he is hoping we will think of him as he goes about this next project of his and offer our support. Hi, uh, my name is Eric, um, as Ron had let you know. Um, and I wanted to kind of uh, invite you uh, to hear about um, the next phase in the life of uh, my wife, Rebecca, and our kids' uh, journey uh, of faith. Um, we have uh, been called by uh, our Lord uh, to go as cross-cultural workers with uh, AFM to uh, Central Asia uh, to serve uh, people there um, who have little to no access uh, to the church or to um, uh, people in the church. Um, and so to kind of give you some background of how we got there um, so that you would know what you'd be participating in and how you'd be um, partnering with us. Uh, when I finished uh, seminary in 2008, um, I spent a year uh, in the country that we we're going to go to um, in the north part, uh, teaching English uh, as a foreign language um, there. Uh, it was a wonderful time that I had there. Uh, I loved the culture. Uh, we got to know um, people really closely, uh, and it was very hard to leave. Um, when I left, I came back. Uh, Rebecca and I got married, uh, and we lived in St. Louis for the next uh, seven years, where we had uh, three of our sons, and uh, I taught uh, ESL. Um, to students from all over the world. Uh, we thought uh, being in the United States was kind of what would uh, be uh, for the rest of our lives. Um, when we moved down to Auburn University, I helped start an uh, international uh, undergraduate program there as well as um, the ESL program that, that, that's there and then moved into uh, tech and we ended up in Richmond, Virginia. Uh, in May 2019, uh, we attended a conference to celebrate 25 years of AFM, and it was there uh, that the Lord really shook uh, my heart uh, and then eventually our families uh, and helped us to realize that, uh, no, it wouldn't be in the U.S. that we'd be <laughs> spending the, the next uh, period of our life, but that we would be called to go overseas uh, to surf in, uh, in Central Asia. Uh, so our plan uh, is to go there uh, to share uh, the love of our Lord uh, with the, those who have not heard and, and do not know um, about uh, our Lord. Uh, and so we would invite you uh, to participate uh, in this uh, work by uh, praying for us uh, and praying for the work that is going to be taking place over there, uh, as well as um, funding uh, and helping to fund the work that will take place over there. Uh, so as uh, a church, uh, we would ask uh, you to come around us and to support us uh, as the larger body of, uh, of our Lord as we go to Central Asia to do this work.